Hi Aries, it's Elle here to do a quick reading for you. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Please continue to do so. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's go ahead and get into it. Thank you God for blessing Aries with a clear, concise message from you. All right, so Aries, it looks like you need to assert yourself better or more, or you need to start to. You also need to assert yourself because people can try to use you, uh, walk over you. But just, you have the Madonna of Roses, just like a rose is beautiful, but it has thorns. And the thorns are there just to protect the rose from, you know, uh, people uh, coming in and just plucking them or, or different insects. Um, the thorns are there uh, as also a cautionary measure. Uh, at times, do not uh, try to manipulate uh, the beauty of of me being open, of me being beautiful, of what I bring to to the world, says the rose. And, and maybe you need to say that about yourself, what you bring to the world, what you bring to any circle. Um, understand that you can be of use, but you don't have to be abused or misused. OK, um, and that is that needs to be your thorn. You need to be assertive. You need to be aggressive in some nature in terms of protecting yourself. Now, also on the flip side of that, it says that if there's something that you want, you don't have to be aggressive, manipulative, um, maybe uh, disingenuous to go about it. Um, be yourself. Know that you offer something, that you are valuable, that you, you have something that is a valuable of value. This could be in terms of maybe friend groups, women groups. I see the four of wands here. They could be an end of a friendship, maybe, or an end of you hanging around a certain group of people or friends or women. Um, maybe even this could be um, in terms of your career and career networking. Something could be ending uh, a business relationship. You know, um, maybe it was one sided. It was upside down. It wasn't mutually beneficial. Uh, therefore, you are um, you're moving on. You um, you feel like you need to end that. You maybe you need to end also within you allowing yourself or putting yourself in position where you could be used, where you could be misused. Um, because also you have to understand your involvement. No one can do anything to you what you don't allow. And if this is love and relationship then it also needs to be that you you don't put you don't lay yourself on the tracks for someone else um if you want to lay on the tracks let it be for for you and you only but it's about not being self-sacrificing to the point where there is no more of you to give or you're just what you have is not valuable because maybe it is given to many or it is giving so given so freely um, make people earn your trust your love, your devotion is what the cards are saying. So you need to end the era of um, showing up to the party um, so open, so trusting, so so vocal. Um, you might need to close down and shut down a bit and um, open up only like a flower blooming. A flower doesn't bloom just automatically. It, it takes, you know, days. It takes, yeah, you know, weeks, days. Um, and then you see it in full bloom. So um, you might need to even approach relationships, love, friend, platonic, family, um, approach relationships in that matter, in that matter where you, um, you don't, uh, you don't just automatically give so much. So hold back, pull back. In some situation that you are in, it, it brought you to religion and spirituality. It brought you to questioning your religion and spirituality, maybe even questioning why you would be in such a dynamic. And then it brought you to, you know, first of all, you questioned the why, and then you, you started to expand on that. And maybe that brought you to understanding people, yourself, psychology, spirituality, religion, um, a lesson altogether. A lot of times you can see this card come out, comes out when there's a lesson need, needing or had to be learned in meeting a certain person or being in a certain place or wherever. Um, there's some emotions that you may have that you hide behind or that you may have kind of pushed down, suppressed, or maybe even repressed within you. Um, you weren't able to 
um, process those emotions in that time, in that present time, there's something that you really need to let come to the surface, okay, so that you can actually um, deal with it. There can be conclusion or resolve here because it just seems like there is um, somebody just pushing everything down to the bottom, trying to forget about it, push it away, maybe even with the help of, you know, drugs, alcohol, sex, whatever, you might need to start to accurately process your emotions so that you can move forward and the forward movement will actually be towards something of value and not just more BS. You don't deal with your BS, you leave it behind, you move on, you'll find what? More BS. So deal with your BS so that you can move on and find something of value and you can be of value. Okay. Um, so this is what I have for you, Aries. I hope that it resonates for you. Um, go over to the website, book your own reading there if you would like to. Thank you. Many blessings to you. Catch me live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night. Um, buy me a coffee if you're feeling moved to. If you took something from the reading, you could give something back. You could click the buy L a coffee link. Thank you guys. Many blessings to you. Take care.